Good afternoon and welcome to another Seminole County Chamber ribbon cutting. Today we're at Jack the Dipper and everybody's sugared up after some yeah. Yeah. So we are in Longwood, Florida at the sixth Jack the Dipper location. The yeah. only one in Florida though, the, all the others are in North Carolina with Rebecca and her family. They have amazing Hershey's ice cream and made to order waffle cones. So I'm gonna pass it over to Rebecca so she can tell you all the special things they have. Hi, thank you so much. I'm Rebecca, Jack the Dipper of Longwood. This is my dad, Mike Martoni. He is the reason that we are here. Uh, he purchased the original locations up in North Carolina four years ago, opened three more, have been very successful, and so we decided collectively to bring one here to Longwood, Florida. This is my family, well, almost all of them. We're missing one of my girls, um, and my husband, Harley, and Layla. And um, we have Hershey's ice cream, like Rebecca said, homemade warm waffle cones, they're delicious. We like to partner with different people in the community to do different programs, um, different fundraising events. We had our first spirit night last night with Rock Lake Middle School, which is a big success. Um, and we're all right. So all quick right. countdown. Three, two, one. Woo! Congratulations, Rebecca and family. I'm going to show them the ice cream. So come on down to Jack the Dipper in Longwood to try some of these awesome flavors. I had the banana pudding earlier. It was to die for. I also tried the deep dish apple pie. Would highly recommend that. You can see they have quite a few flavors. And for our vegans, they even have two oat milk ice cream flavors, chocolate chunk and classic cookie. So even if you're vegan and you don't do dairy, you can come down and enjoy some ice cream at Jack the Dipper. The rest of their storefront, like Rebecca was talking about, those homemade waffle cones, waffle makers. And they do have some upcoming events to plug. On October 15th, they have a first responders night. So come on down from one to four to meet some first responders and share some ice cream. They also have some upcoming events coming up for the holidays. So make sure you check them out as it starts to get a little cooler. They'll be doing some stuff outdoors. Thanks so much for joining us for another Seminole Chamber ribbon cutting. We will see you guys next time.